guys, welcome back to the channel. Doing a video review for Dixon Fabrications at the moment, just editing it and it's taking a little bit longer than what I thought to be fair, but I want that to be right for you guys. So uh, yeah, welcome back to the channel. As you saw, a bit of drone footage, need plenty of practice on that. <laughs> if anybody's got any hints and tips, go for it, send them, put them in the comments like. Um, mentioning that as well, I have looked at uh, YouTube and a lot of you guys are watching the video for longer amount of time and giving it a thumbs up which i really do appreciate um it does help with youtube and things like that so fantastic thanks for that um, like i say if you want to, if you're not subscribed and you're new hit the subscribe button and give it a share and anything like that so yeah not a problem so video update realistically just for this week because i did say as of, as of the new year i'm going to start bringing a video out every week even if i'm not actually showing you something i just want to let you know i'm still here um as for as you can tell, I'm in the garage. The project we started on Instagram, as you saw, is still as it was. We haven't had much time on that. This week's been a bit of a nightmare week, week for me, uh, personally. If you're self-employed and you've got a mortgage before, or you're trying to get a mortgage, you know what I mean. It's just a faff, complete faff. So yeah, we, we're do, trying to do that this week. Um, just a nightmare, accountants, this, that, and the other. So yeah, there's that. Uh, I'll show you Steve's motor. Uh, like I said, so he's actually wrapped in that and it's looking really nice. It's a really nice purple to be fair. We're probably going to end up doing a full video on Steve's, I would have said, once it's all done. Um, it's the same as everything guys, it's money, time. Um, obviously you need to work to get the money to then spend it on the Land Rovers. It's one of those things. Um, as for, like I said, the video review for the Dixons, I'm about halfway through it i need to get i want to get you a, a full footage video of basically um getting the products seeing what the products it's like itself really close up things like that because like i say guys if you're spending a lot of money you want to know what's going on so uh yeah be that it'll be installing it okay customer service wise bits and bobs like that I'm not endorsed by Dixon Fabrications. I'm not an ambassador. I'm not anything like that. So I just want to put that out there. I'm not for anybody. I don't endorse the products, you know. You know, I've got Bear Mac products here. I've got uh, Dirt Monkey Off-Road products. I've got HD bars to go <laughs> Honestly, uh, there's a lot of product. I, if I did a product review for every part that was on my car, um, it would be like 60 videos later. Do you know what I mean? And I... I I'm not into that. I'm really not sort of thing. But I want to do a good video for this because I'll, I'll tell you now the products that I'm, uh, you know, that we've received are absolutely banging. They really are. Uh, quality wise, they're spot on. They really are. It is Friday, so having a cheeky beer. Um, yeah, that's about it really. To be fair, I say we. I hope we're all doing well with lockdown, and you know it, it affects us all. It's one of those things. It's a bit shitty. Can't get out, can't go green laning, can't go camping. And the weather's not been great as well. I'm not running the land at the minute because I'm just doing bits of mods, like say, steering bars at the same time. I'm not going to video it all. Um, so yeah, I don't know when the video, excuse me, I don't know when the video is going to be out for the uh, rock sliders. But like I said before, I want it, I want it to be right, the video. I want to show you the ins, the outs, everything that you should need to know about that. Because like I say, if you're spending money, you want to know uh, what these products are like. I'll tell you what, let's go show you Steve's truck. So there's one door, as you can see. It's lovely, nice purple colour. It really is. Looked quite light in that picture, to be fair. But as running up, you can see, that's the project that we've still got as a project. Um, underneath, it's not too bad, to be fair. Uh, I think, yes, yeah, on this side there, there we go. Um, we've got it on chock wood at the minute, but that sill there is absolutely knackered. So we're gonna have to do that anyway before you know we get this sorted. But yeah, look, look at the color of Steve's. It's um, it really does ping out, and you can see the Raptor on it. Um, he's planning. I think he planned for eight liters, and he's he's only done four. Steve, you you got one liter left? He's out there somewhere. I think he has. I think he's only used three. He's going black on the roof. Still got to do that bit up there. Going black on the roof. But yeah, he wants to get another coat on there. Um, so he's planning for another four litres of that. But you can see the actual colour. 
The light's probably not doing it justice, but yeah, there you go. You can see it right there sort of thing, guys. So it's uh, bang on. Bar, when he painted it, went away for the night, absolutely chucked it down, and we ain't got the best roof, and this is what happened. So he came back in and pissed off is probably not the word, <laughs> to be fair. So, but it's a good job he's giving it another coat because it's going over that anyway. But honestly, guys, the effect is you probably can't see it on the camera. Um, but yeah, no, it's bang on. What did you say you used? Is it three litres on that so far? You've used the four. Yeah, so he's used the four, but he's planning. I said we, we said about eight. Eight's probably overdoing it, but why not? Why not go for more on there? Um, and you'll see what that, that finishes out like anyway. And like I said, he's going black on the roof up there. Some roof's going. He's already took that out and put a metal panel in there instead. Um, you're going for a bed in the back, aren't you? Bed in the back, TV on the back door. Banging. But yeah, let us know what you think about the colour, guys. There's not a lot out there, things like that. So... That's the first time we've used that tint. Well, say, tell a lie. Second time we've used the tintable. Um, first time was on my son's BMX, and it didn't really go how we wanted it to, but on Steve's, it's gone absolutely spot on, colour-wise. Um, what did it have to be? Solvent. It had to be a solvent-based uh, colour that you wanted to tint, use the tintable with. Um, and I think we used maybe a water-based or something on my lad's bike. Um, but, yeah, the... The solvent base, as you can see, it is absolutely, uh, yeah, going to stick out like a sore thumb boy. <laughs> so there you go, guys. There's not a lot to update on. It was just an update on this week. Uh, got a really good video, obviously, with the uh, rock sliders coming up. Uh, I just need to get things in line for that, but I have been really busy this week. I'm going to do a full video on Steve's. Like I say, you've seen the project, <laughs> project and half. Um, I'm actually waiting as well for... Um, some guys just on this on this estate here to come and shot blast the chassis we've got waiting for that. Um, once they've shot blast it, I can get that prime, I can get that in, and then we can start chopping and changing parts and things like that. Obviously, we've got a you've seen the unit we've got. We've got to work with what we've got, so we haven't got a massive unit. So we need to, it's like one vehicle in, one vehicle out. Um, so yeah, not a lot to update on, guys. But just to let you know, we're still here. Chuck a comment below if you've got any questions, anything like that. If you like that Raptor, give us a thumbs up. Uh, like I say, he's going to be doing another coat on that. Um, yeah, it would be really good to do a full overview of Steve's once we've got it done. Um, and yeah, I think Steve's well ready for getting it on the road now. <laughs> he was probably ready about six months ago. But like I say, guys, it's time, it's money. You know, uh, you, you can't always get free time to do the things that you want to do sort of thing. So it's one of those. But yeah. Guys, have a good weekend. Um, like I say, there's plenty in the pipeline. You know that. It's just me having the time to do it and Steve having the time to do it. Um, but guys, if you like the video, give us a thumbs up. Have a beer. Um, chill out. Um, try and, like I say, enjoy lockdown as much as possible. Because we are in lockdown in the UK. Can't really enjoy it, but try and make the most of it. It's one of those things. We've all got to go through it. Keep your heads high. And uh, yeah, we'll see you next time. Take care.